Here's how to apply the 80-20 rule to your business to increase profits and reduce headaches. So there's a lot of different versions of the 80-20 rule. So for today's example, the 80-20 rule applies to 80% of the headaches in your business are caused by 20% of the customers. So for example, we run a business that basically picks student belongings up in May, stores them for the summer months, and then returns it to students' new housing when they return in August. Early on in our business cycle, we used to offer an add-on option called Summer Session. Basically, it was for students that were coming back to their university after three weeks of being home. So basically, we would pick their stuff up in May, store it for three weeks, and then we'd re-deliver it to them in June for their summer classes, and we'd pick it up again in July, and then we'd drop it off again in August. So that was four moves total, all for the exact same four months. Again, to keep costs down for the actual customers, we were offering this as an upcharge for only $100. Huge mistake. We tried to cater to every single customer situation and make everybody happy. And in doing so, we caused ourselves so many headaches and actually lowered our total satisfaction. These moves were the most expensive for us on a cost basis, and they took all of our staff's time all summer long coordinating these one individual moves because it added so much more volume. And we lost the efficiency of being able to deliver more than one student on the same debt. Not to mention that these customers were often the most upset in terms of the value they got from our service because their bills were $100 more than the average because they chose the add-on. So when we stopped offering that, cutting out those bottom 20% of customers was the best thing that we could ever do for our business and it drastically increased profit and allowed us to focus on the people that we could give the most value to at the cheapest price.